Hello everybody, so today we are going to be doing some DIYs that are actually decor DIYs. So you don't have to do these exact things. If you want, you can just substitute some things, just get an idea out of this, but you're always welcome to do the exact thing. So this DIY is going to cost about 2 to $4, depending on what materials you have on hand. So what you're going to do is, as you can see, I have this cylinder base from Dollar Tree, and this is what the cork sheet looks like. So just so you know what it looks like if you want to find it there. So I just cut a little piece and stuck it on here because it's an adhesive cork sheet. So you just peel off the back and there's a little sticky side and just stick it on there. And as you can see, I also have some pine cones, which these you should have maybe in your backyard. Or you can go to the park and collect some. Um... And then also what you can do is you can take some twine or string, as you can see right here, I just used some twine from Amazon, and then some wooden beads from Amazon as well. And basically what you do is just string the beads on. I did some cute little patterns, so I did a larger bead, two smaller beads, a larger bead, two smaller beads. And I also have another one right here that is just small bigger, 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 and then it just goes down to smaller ones again. So the first thing you're going to want to do is I'm just going to stand up the vase. You don't need to put cork all the way around. Just kind of make it look good at the front. So the first step is put in your beads. So this is the first bead thing that I'm going to put in first. And make sure that maybe the part that's just more stringy is at the bottom, so it's just not as visible. So this one I'm just going to kind of use it as the bottom, or you can use some foam or maybe a plastic, scrunched up plastic bag to kind of elevate the bottom part. So then I have these ones which I think will just look nicer, but you can really just do anything that you'd like. And I'm going to place it in by the bottom as I told you before and they're kind of going to take a shape in their own unique way which just looks really nice and decor so don't stress about it not looking too perfect then as you can see i have my pine cones over here and i'm just going to place them in one by one and remember it doesn't have to be perfect because this is just gonna look like a pretty natural diy with the wooden beads and the pine cones and the cork and i don't think i'll put this this pine cone in but you can always just put any amount of pine cones you want I'll just keep it in for now but then you can see what it looks like this way so it looks pretty nice and it's also a very neutral DIY and I'm just really happy with how it turned out so if you just want to recap the steps I can tell you so just use this adhesive cork sheet from Dollar Tree or you can probably find it in other places as well and cut it stick it on string some wooden beads put it in and then just put in some pine cones or any decoration you'd like and then also this is kind of more of like a neutral it could be for fall maybe not as much for summer but if you want to use it for winter you can and if you want you can even add um a flocked look to the pine cones and i'm just really happy with how this turned out i think it looks really nice and just a great diy for any time of the year really and remember you can also add other things make sure to be creative and you can substitute some items if you maybe don't have them at home you don't you don't need to put any of these things and you can probably put maybe some fake plant stems maybe it could be a vase for real flowers that you might find or anything like that and yeah that's our first DIY and this is just how it's going to look now for our next DIY what you're going to need is some spray paint and 